Hey, um, I'm Myrna. I am a, I'm a giftless student and I also work at Beatley Library at Simmons College. So how do you feel about the conference so far? What have you taken away from it? Um, it's been really interesting to see how this project developed and to see where it might go. Um, I'm really curious as to what exactly will happen next. I think it's really important to kind of do some testing to see how this will really work for users. Um, so I think that might be an appropriate next step, but it'll be interesting to see what they decide to do. So. And so do you have any new conception of what the next step of the should be at this conference? Any thoughts on that? Well, I mean, I think for me it'd be user um, usability testing to see if this, whatever they go with, really will work for the user. So. Did any of the biggest prints stand out to you from the presentation just now? Um, trying to remember all of them. Uh, <laughs> I did like the bookworm idea. Um, I think it is a good question as to whether or not this will be useful beyond like academic libraries. Um, I do work in an academic library now, so I think it would be useful there. But how would the average user in a public library or in, or in any other sort of state or mode use that? So, yeah. And so what's your personal vision for DPLA? Either as a user or as a library? Um, I kind of see it as like, what Google is missing. Um, it's Google will give you like so many results that you have kind of have to go through yourself to determine whether or not they're actually useful to you. Um, and this kind of has already like picked out the stuff that might not be as, as useful, if that makes sense. So, yeah. Yeah, you're